Wait, where's my cat? Look at my cat. Oh my <laughs> word. <laughs> you poor, poor it. thing. He's just wearing a couple of pots. <laughs> Literally, all I can see now is that cat just going, kill me, please. <laughs> If I see a rare pet, I am going to stop mid and give and fight. Another one? Um. Uh. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, hey, you're conveniently. No, 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 He's screaming. <laughs> I gave him one job and he went, nah. <laughs> oh. Why did he just go up and then back down? <laughs> It was like, like, I didn't I'm like my leave? first no, entrance. No, okay, let me do yeah. it. Let me do it again. <laughs> let me try this again. Okay, I'm ready. I don't like how much damage he's instantly doing to me. Stop screaming! He's a screamer. I, I missed everything, and he's screaming some more. He genuinely sounds in pain. Like, that's the kind of sound you make if oh. you stand on Lego. <laughs> <laughs> Just straight up, like... <sighs> Look at him! He's quite beautiful. He's just... Does he not freak you out a little bit? Not really. I really like, like it, actually. Like, the scales that are hanging off him in kind of like a bunch. They almost look like a row of egg sacs. It kind of... Uh, you know, I kind of get like a sort of like crawling skin sort of... Mm. All right. I've mounted him. He just, he just dropped some balls and blew them up. I think focusing on tails seems a great idea, given that his tail yeah. seems to be a oh. source of explosions. So this, everybody, yeah. is Bezelgeus. Bezelgeus, Bezel Goose. One of Bezel, the three. Bezel Goose. Bezel Goose, okay. <laughs> and he is essentially a invader that roams all territories and whose very existence is to make Ooh, your existence hell. He will arrive on your innocent expedition request. You know, he's not invited. He don't want to see him, but he will show up all the same, and he will make you actually hate yourself by essentially doing a bombing run with explosive scales, Look, which I think will you blow you quite literally to hell, where he is also waiting to then fuck you up a second time. This guy is Fury on wings, and uh, we're going to try and kill him because we're absolute fucking masochists. Fury on a bicycle. What? He's, he's ow, bicycle. Like, I just gave a huge impassioned speech around why this guy is awful, and then all I hear at the end is, GET ON A BICYCLE! No, Fury on a bicycle. I didn't say get on a bicycle. Are you crazy? <laughs> <laughs> My bad, Cotton. <laughs> <laughs> oh, careful. Boom! Uh, he's up. That. And why he's does up. he keep hopping? Oh, it makes him drop bombs. Oh yeah, it shakes off his scales. It's a scale shaker. Why does he have explosive scales? Oh, like... look, his tail's out of ammo. His tail is out of ammo! It's regrowing! I just watched it regrow. That's actually really cool. <laughs> we are fighting a monster whom you can accurately say his tail is out of ammo. <laughs> <laughs> I love this game. I love this game so much. <laughs> All right, I'm going to bring him down again as soon as I can. Let's uh, cut that bad boy off straight up. 9-4, that's the plan, Roger. 9-4, Roger. And here we go. Oh, that was a tasty amount of damage. Absolutely delicious. He is cheating currently by putting most of his tail in a rock. In the rock, yeah. But, you know, I'll, I'll, I won't. Wow, he doesn't stay down for I long. I won't begrudge him that. Well, no, I mean, I, I don't think you can really keep Fury on wings down for that He's long. He's gone. All right, Connor, cool. target's down there. Okay, yeah. Okay, I need... Wait, where have you... I'm, I'm, I'm also watching from a ledge, but it's a different ledge. <laughs> C C wait. Are you, are you on a lower Hello? ledge, or...? Yeah. Damn it, Cotton! We're just yelling at each other from different clip it's faces. It's also a ledge, though. Don't worry. <laughs> Yeah, he's about 30 feet that way! Oh, he's there! Okay! <laughs> Jesus Christ! We should not be here! We we should have been stopped by fucking Anjanath. Like, seriously. Oh my god, alright. Oh hey, you made it. How's it going? <laughs> oh, fancy seeing I see. Ooh, okay, I got like a- Fancy seeing him here. You fancy seeing him here, really. 
I is love his fool? golden, like, ball-y scales. Outside of the explosive ones, the rest of him is really nice. Yeah, for sure. Oh, oh, oh. oh I missed. Oh, no. So, the thing is, he seems to drop his scales, put them in the ground, and then impact makes them kind of unstable and sends yeah. them off. So, he uh, first deploys them almost like mines around the place and then triggers a sort of chain reaction that is very painful. I'm impressed that he was smart enough to work out how to do that, though. It's like, got to be terrifying like, for young yeah. Beazle Goose, right? Like, they're just a... Like, I'm shedding, I'm shedding mines. <laughs> like, they're just a baby one day, and... Now you must impact them. <laughs> no, but, like, they're just a, a young Beazle Goose going through Beazle Goose adolescence, and they shed their first scale, and they're like, what the, the hell is... What the hell is... <laughs> ah! Oh! Mom! Mom! <laughs> Don't touch it! Don't touch it! <laughs> now listen, son. All Beazel Goose go through this process where your body I becomes... I got his tail! You did get his tail. Where your body becomes explosive. Why? Well, why? Now don't question it, son. <laughs> but if you ever fight in Oh, God. Hunters, this is a bad corner. Yeah, this is not a good corner. I want to leave. Oh, my God. So we've kind of halved his ammo count on his scale, which is really, yeah. really good. Come at us, you well, glowing, well, you sexy bastard. Oh, God. Oh, bombing run! Bombing run! <sighs> That's so cool! Look at him! Cool. Look at him go! Wow. Oh, you are one of my favorites, buddy. You really I are. Like and so far, you're not that bitch of a fight, which is really cool. Like, I feel threatened, but I don't yeah. feel like, how in the world? Yeah. Where are you going? Uh, there's an Azure Rathalos over there. Little hop. Oh, yeah. Yep. Azure Rathalos. Come to say hi. We are. I'm going to. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Did you want his tail by any chance? I, 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 I got away with that spectacularly. I don't know how. I don't know why, but I will accept it. Oh, it's such an innovative fight, though. I love it so much. Goodbye. He's, he's off. I want his tail now. You get his tail, and congrats on the gem. Thank you. Oh, a campsite. Convenient. I'm not going to tell you where it is. I mean, I can see you. No, 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 no! You don't. I'm not gonna tell you. It's, it's not. No, no, no! It's not. Not in here. No, so what's in no, here? no, no! It's not. It's not in here. It's not. No, come back. What it's is this? dangerous in there. No. Is it though? Damn it! Can't believe you oh. wouldn't listen. Oh God! Refuse into one you genuine danger. Genuine camp danger. <laughs> genuine danger. Uh, I, I'm. I'm actually kind of lost. If I'm honest with you. Okay. Oh. Oh. oh, is he just sleeping? Oh, he's sleeping. Look at him. He's having a nap. He's kind of cute when he's, he's asleep. Cute. Yeah, he's not bad. Run! <gasps> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> that wasn't me, I swear. That was, that was a roller coaster I wasn't prepared for, man. Like, come on, what the hell? <laughs> Oh, oh, it's a satisfying. Oh combo. my god, I'm really happy sliding. he's gone here because I can do this. Okay. Okay. What? 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 Are you... Oh, bombing run. No, oh, come bombing back. Run. Yeah, it's bombing run. Isn't it? I love that we are actually again able to describe a monster as doing a bombing run yeah. on us. Okay, come back down. And, yep, the, and then he go. just fucking face plants the floor. It'd be really funny if this entire time it turns out that he's not resistant to explosions. <laughs> and it's actually just Sexy. really painful for him to be part of this fight. Well, I mean, there are tons of animals where the best way for them to defend themselves actually does hurt them. Yeah, to be fair, he might be like a giant bee. And his stings yeah. are explosions. Be Beezelgus. Beazel, oh, that's not actually the origin. No, but, it's, but no. like I, a good. Also, his name isn't even spelt that way. No, just but good, like say. good overall, like just uh, humor, connection. Again, yeah, yeah, like well, well done. Thank you. <laughs> if I had to evaluate your contribution, I'd like him to come down a bit further so I can roll on him. Oh God! Oh, please, 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 please come over here. Okay. Bye. He's dropping some. 
scales, I think. Getting a big hit in. <laughs> Lovely. I'm really suspicious. Like, he's the kind of monster where I feel like I'm never actually safe. So no matter what's no. happening, I'm fully expecting to suddenly be, like, one shot. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Ooh, what a lovely, lovely roll. I, Ooh. Am I okay? I think I'm okay. Are you okay? No. I will be. No, I looked and you on half health and literally on fire. I, I did answer my own question there. I'll, I'll be fine in a moment, though. Ooh. Just give me a second. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, good. Oh. Oh, one good solid hit is like a good 70% of my health bar. It's yeah. really concerning. Same. <sighs> she bombing run or just up and down? I'm just playing very gentle hit and run with him. Yeah, that's what I've been doing for a bit now. Basically since his tail come out, because his tail was only the place that I felt safe. Well, fortunately I have a pretty good weapon for hit and run. In fact, the best weapon for hit and run. If he goes back to the slope, then I have a really good weapon for it. But come here, on. not as come good. Come at me. No, no, not that fast. <laughs> He's just doing what you asked. Oh, He's no, he'll leave, leave the locale. No. Basil Gius. That's what I was worried about. Ow. What? I'm not sure hey, what really happened to us there, but I guess we had the audacity to run. We did have the audacity to run. We did. Oh, what's that? smack it really hard and hope it helps. Alright, I guess we have no choice but to be aggressive. Essentially fainting doesn't matter because it's an expedition, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try and hammer him. Oh no. Oh oh my god, there's mines everywhere. <laughs> He's so so powerful and healthy and full of life. You're like a parent describing their child happily. <laughs> I'm coming. Don't let him leave. I'll try my best, but I make no promises. He's moving. I tried. No. This will definitely wake him up, whether it's the one that we want to. Yeah, yeah. 700, baby. That's a lot of hundreds. Oh, <laughs> nice. 700 babies. Being babies. Stunned. 700 babies. I want to eat 700 babies! Oh my god! Whoa! Ooh. You saw me, that's not him leaving. He's just instantly like, actually, you know what? Bye! <laughs> he's gone, he's gone. Disappoint! Oh, look, you can't fault his tactical awareness. Oh yes, that was our first go at Basil Goose, and oh yes, as a one-off in Prube, I kind of just want to have a little chat with you guys, primarily about... Beazle over here because I think he's absolutely wonderful and uh, he's not the only one I think's wonderful. I, I think you guys are. Oh, and by the way, how, how good was that tail slice? You just, I, I, I'm, I was really pleased with that. But I want to just thank you guys for the amazing support and positive reception on this playthrough. I am absolutely adoring making it and putting just as much time and effort into it as I physically can. I think it's the best playthrough I've done, probably, and despite being held back by Cotton, clearly... That's not true. I have just been overwhelmed by your lovely uh, comments. It, it's It's been fantastic. So, because of that, and because of the overwhelming request for it, I did want to show you guys, despite it not being a story quest, our first proper attempt at killing Basil Goose. Now, unfortunately, he wasn't completely blind, because we had kind of the shadow of him appear on a few farming expeditions and investigations that we did kind of between episodes. So sadly, the initial, whoa, wasn't caught on camera, but we never fought him. We never stayed long enough to see moves. We never properly looked at him. We always ran away. So really, this was as blind as it could be. But I, I, I do want to let you guys know that. But 
ultimately, I, I think he's such a fantastic monster. As I said in the thing, a very fair but intense and visually stimulating visceral fight that's just so high action the entire way through. It really is an intense dance of death with this guy, and I think he's a beautiful invading monster. Like, just hearing that piercing screech, letting his battle music cut out whatever's you were fighting and be replaced with his own, and then the bombs start dropping, the explosions start firing, and you have to make a choice. Try and make this work. Try and let Basil equal parts fuck your day and the monsters you were fighting and hope you kind of come out on top, or, well, reach for your dung pods and just pray that he's feeling merciful. Spoiler, he's not. Now, sadly, he doesn't have any turf wars, which is... Ah, I, I really wanted some. Admittedly... If a Basil Gears shows up, well, then there's already no question whose turf it now is, so they would be a little bit superfluous. But I hope that as he is an invading monster, and ah, oh, he's so beautifully designed, he, oh, I, I love him, and he's in range mode and the glow, and ah, oh, he's a sexy bastard. I do hope when the pickle gets added in the DLC coming up, that he does have a turf war with Basil. They're both invading monsters that show up and just make you really question your life choices, so I'm super interested in seeing which one comes out on top. A part of me thinks that Devil Joe's just gonna start riding Basil Gooses into battle, which would be what hell, just surfing the bomber plane into the zone. He arrives, the bombs drop, the giant pickle death machine leaps off his back and lands with a thud and the ground shakes. They high five and start just absolutely decimating you in brutal teamwork. Uh, that would be, that would be amazing, but more likely given that they are both highly aggressive, uh, incredibly uh, powerful hunters, they're, they're gonna come to blows, but that's fair enough. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to give you my take on him. I, I do think he shows up a little bit too often and it kind of takes away the magic intenseness of when he does appear and he uh, kind of uh, he kind of enters into the realm of uh, not again once you do farm him enough but I, I don't think that should be taken away it was such a wild ride much like the one that I'm that I'm uh, currently taking part in when you first meet this guy when you first fight him when you first farm him and honestly I think he might be my favorite new non elder dragon monster added to the game by actually quite a good margin. Get down, Mr. President! Oh, oh, oh. Wonderful in every single way. So, yeah, I, I thought it would be nice to just have that kind of talk with you guys. I, I imagine most of you probably switched off as soon as the kind of main part of the episode finished. Well, the joke's on you because there's another part coming, coming up, so... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> But as for coming up, by the way, every Prove episode from now onwards is, oh, it, it, it kind of begins now. It really does. So look forward to that. And also, this was my genuine first kill on a Basil Goose. This is how I did it. Enjoy this and enjoy the end of the episode proper. Some thorns. Look, you, you don't. We don't both see them. Oh. But I, but I found a footprint anyways over here while you were asking how far in I was, and it finished it. Oh, convenient. We'll put a quest soon. In the meantime, it's something you should know. We figured out what it feeds on. Is it elder dragons? Oh, it's other. <gasps> what? Ah, this shocking, is but crazy. true. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you, man. <laughs> oh. What? Okay. So... So apparently it wasn't helping Zora, it was actually trying to hunt it. Trying to eat him? What? Do you mean us versus Nergigante Handler? Everything you've been involved in so far has been a disaster. She did give us some rocks when we first got to the Rotten Vale to hit Great Juros in the face. Okay. My bad. She's done like one thing. 
Well, hopefully we can bring her along to Nergigante just as a kind of I want to see what happens. But either way, thanks for watching, everyone. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe for more. And uh, next time, Nergigante. Oh, I'm excited, Cotton! Rage gaming with the video flow. But that's all that's really relevant at the mo. But I'm still gonna leave this up so you patrons know that I love you even though the outro's no longer that kind of relevant. But the new one's being worked on and it's gonna be a truly badass song. And don't worry, I won't be doing any rapping on it. I'm gonna go now. Uh, this was shit.